hello everyone and welcome to how to guide videos in this video I am going to show how to create 3d contour lines in map box so let's go to the site you have to have an account to open this site so go to account and then go to studio and then creating new style because I am making 3D contour lines in my box so this is the best uh, uh, template for contour because it's already got all the contours all over the world so I will select that one and customized outdoor contour template So I will write the location it's in Pakistan it's very high mountains in Pakistan like K2 and uh, there are some people coming all over the world for hiking so but I wanted to see I don't know the proper name of that mountain but uh, I know the location it's something like like Karan Karan Ko, ko means mountain in our, in our language so it is somewhere here <coughs> um, yeah, it must be somewhere here oh, this is Karanko is here so <coughs> I will make uh, 3d control lines here and first I will check out what is the highest level of the contour uh, this is 6000 6850 and the next this one is 6800 so 50 meters uh, contour uh, elevations here not the vertical distance uh, not the horizontal distance but the vertical distance which is elevation so 50 meter elevation and these <coughs> primary lines are 50 meters apart in elevation and these secondary lines are 10 meters apart so uh, i'm going to create a 3d contour uh, uh, a model here so click anywhere and go to layers go to control lines <coughs> and you will find that con these are control lines and you will find these control lines here so I will duplicate these control lines first so go to duplicate and then uh, write any the name I will write uh, uh, project 2 maybe project 2 and click here then uh, I will uh, go to select data and going to type line I have to fill out this one with the uh, extrusions so it will become all green because all these control values are going to be in one color and horizontal so now it is filled out now I will go back to style and in style I will change the color because I wanted to show the contours in different colors and uh, yes go to style across data range go into elevation because I am looking all these 3d things in elevation um, <coughs> if I check it here elevation range is from uh, 410 and 8840 so my uh, value should be in between these uh, these two uh, range so I will start with because these areas are very high so I will start around 2000 meters so I will start 2000 meters and I will change the color to bright red here and 
Yes, I think it's okay. And done it. And uh, add another layer. Or you can say another contour. A bit different color. And I'm making uh, another color maybe yellowish type of thing. Yeah, this, uh oh. This one looks to me a bit better. Yep. <coughs> and I'm keeping the range nearly, I'm going uh, further up 1000 meters. So it, last one was 2000, this one I will keep it on 3000. <coughs> and done. And the next another layer. layer. This layer I will make uh, 4000. And I will change the color into uh, something like like this green. Done. Another layer. So 2000, 3000, 4000 I will make another layer 5000 because I am going at the interval of 1000 meters. <coughs> so this one is 5000. And the color may be uh, something like that, 5000. And this one, add another layer, uh, 6000. <coughs> and this color will be, first I will write the value, 6000. And the color will be for this range maybe around somewhere bluish or uh, something like not blue something like opaque type of blue and then uh, did i put the value yes i put the value in and then i will put another value uh, about uh, seven thousand because I can put the value up to the 8840. So this is 7000 and this one I will go for very much purpley color. Something like uh, this. Yep. And done. The last value which is 8000 I will keep it on this one. And press OK. Done. So this is at the moment it is only in uh, only in plane and in horizontal. I did not add the height yet. So I'll go for the height, doing doing the same thing, going for elevation. Height I will start from zero, zero meters, and then done. The next height I will put on. Uh, same value 8840 I think I make one extra zero here remove that one yep so this is the value So this is the 3D uh, uh, model for the mountains. If I move it to the pitch type of locations, so this is the uh, what to say, Karan Ko Karan Ko mountain in 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 the range of near the K2. So this is my. Uh, uh, ninth video for making the model in 3, 3D model for in contours. Thank you for watching. Hope you like it. Thank you. Bye.